Hi, I'm Delvane Cockatoo Collins. I'm an independent artist. I live and from um, Minjeriba, North Stradbroke Island. In 2016, I was accepted as a, um, an artist to travel to Guam for the Festival of Pacific Arts. And my proposal was to do collaborative uh, lino workshop printing with artists who were attending the festival. While I was accepted, I needed to provide all of the materials, which I wasn't aware about from that original application. And I only had a short time, like three weeks from the time I was sort of notified to the time that we were due to fly out. And so with the RADIF grant, it was a quick response. So I was able to um, apply and get some funding for the materials, which then got shipped off to Guam and um, I was able to then provide workshops I think for more than 60 different artists. With the workshops that I did in Guam it was for artists only and they were from right throughout the Pacific so Fiji, Taiwan, New Zealand, um, Samoa, Tonga, so a whole range of countries and so having artist workshops only allows you to kind of grow, learn from each other and share. The workshops that I provided were um, material or fabric uh, lino printing um, workshops. So each person had a piece of fabric that was sewn and ready to be hung as a wall hanging and a lino tile each, all the uh, different tools that are needed to create a piece of work. And I wanted them to share something that was shareable uh, about their attendance at the festival. So each person created their own piece and each other artist then printed on each fabric. So if there was a workshop of 12 artists, there was 13 pieces. Each artist then printed lino on each of the fabric. So you would take home a piece from all different countries. And then I was able to keep the 13th piece. So it was a representation of that particular workshop. So that was the collaborative part. Everyone contributed to a piece of art that each artist got to take home. And when I returned, I did an exhibition at RPAC. And so all of the different workshop pieces were on there as well as photographs and stories from the Festival of Pacific Arts, which was 2016. One artist, um, Fiona Foley, she said to look at different opportunities and how you can be part of them. Don't let there be any barriers, like this can be a way to, you know, to be able to contribute. So for me, I think it was a, a great proposal because it wasn't just benefiting me, it was benefiting a broad range of other artists. I found out about quick response, I think because I always see different bits of information coming from council, whether it's on social media and there would have been multiple ways of being told that this was open and available. In terms of words of advice for other artists, I think if you've got an idea, just explore that with Elaine and see how a RADIF grant or uh, a quick response grant will assist with your idea. As artists, you have to continually think about what's next and sometimes um, you may not have the resources to do that, but something like this could provide a solution for you. 